Hey, hey guys, how are you? Good, Hayden. Good. How are you? Um, I'm very good. I'm, good. Uh, I am very excited to see this version of Batman, which is crazy to me because it's a Lego movie with Batman. What did you guys, how did much of yourselves did you guys put in these characters? Because these are very well-known characters and you're bringing them, you know, giving them new life. It's a take on them for sure. I mean, it's a take on the Batman world mm -hmm. that is uh, obviously playing for, uh, for humor and um, poking fun in a way at the Batman thing while paying homage to it. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, but my, the, the, my version of Robin in this, which was already, you know, very kind of figured out by the time I was brought on, was this version of him that I haven't seen before, really, where he's this child, and he's um, just wants to be loved and just wants to glom on to Batman and um, hang on tight. So that was kind of, you know, a take that I haven't seen before. Yeah, you definitely. Know. And with you, too, especially, with the Joker. He's... I don't think there's any element of that. I, I mean, you bring your own ideas, yeah. uh, for sure. You know, it's it's a it's a little eggshelly because you, you know there's a built-in audience that... <laughs> I mean, there's no more nerds than there are around the, than the Batman movies. <laughs> I mean, jeez. It's aggressive. It's aggressive, it's aggressive, aggressive specimen, nerds. Yeah. You think? Aggressive nerds that I frankly, I mean. It's an aggressive strain of nerds. Yeah. Which, yeah. you know. If they you, love their franchise, man. They love their franchises and their french fries. I'll try that. Um, the veal, as they call them. Uh, you know, you want to be respectful to it. You yeah. do. You don't want to just. Oh, I'm gonna go have my own way and do my own thing and my own interpretation, which you should do. But but you have to have a little bit of a keep the integrity of that and what the integrity of the Joker is. I'm not quite sure, uh, but at least the integrity of the uh, the character it, it itself. Yeah. Um, which not having too much knowledge, not a nerd's knowledge uh, of Batman. I mean. I, I have obviously, as I think, if you're born in this country, you have some knowledge of Batman, and sure. Uh, but the nerd knowledge intimidates me, and that's yeah. scary. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm sure a couple of nerds are going to come up to me at an airport and go, you know, actually, Joker doesn't talk like that. <laughs> uh, if you read the, you know, that kind of thing. That's you haven't had that conversation though, yet. Yeah. Uh, no, not yet. <laughs> not yet. Let's just say I'll be shaving my beard. <laughs> yes, yeah, you. Sure. Well, it could be useful, even if it fails, just as a cautionary tale to um, other actors how not to do it. That's don't a good do point. Don't do it this way. Yeah, it's like don't do it this way. Yeah. It's useful. Yeah. <laughs> so you don't feel totally useless. Not at all. You paved the way. <laughs> well, it's funny you say that because, yes, DC fans have been, especially we've seen them very, they're very proud of their whatever it is. They yeah. want to see their icon on the big screen. I guess you can't blame them because it's this amazing world. Yeah. It's exciting. You know, yeah, see, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. What was the most fun with you? I mean, did, did you wear pants during filming, or did you just take them off all the time? Because that would have been Method Man. It would have been Method Man. <laughs> but, but I no, I kept the Method Man did yeah. that. <laughs> As concert shows, so all the time. <laughs> yeah, no, that's that's just short of how much I care. <laughs> I take pants off while recording. Well, you but, uh, <laughs> I kept them on. <laughs> 